and today we are going to Silver Lake Sand Dune. So trailer is finally ready for some camping. We got the AC unit in and uh, right now we're just hooking up to Paul's truck. But uh, we're taking Paul's truck out on the dunes. Brent's on his way. He's having a bunch of uh, transmission problems so we're probably not going to take his out. But we're going to be finally getting my truck with the new 37s out on the dunes. We're also buying my parents for the winter, so it should be a good weekend. Check it out. All right, so we are finally at the campsite, getting the trailer all set up. So we got the power running, Wi-Fi to the TV. Uh, we're gonna get our bed set up and everything. Check out our freaking kitchen area. So, I just had a TV, but we got our toaster oven, coffee maker, we got an gr electric griddle down there for here, and then we got this uh, gas one for cooking like burgers and stuff outside, so we got the AC pumping, look at that, 69 degrees, ah. but uh, yeah, the trailer is looking sweet, it's going to be super comfy, and the dunes tomorrow are going to be awesome, so stay tuned for that. In the sky, gazing far into the night, I raise my hand to the fire, but it's no use, cause you can't stop it from shining through, it's true, baby let the light shine through, if you believe it's true, baby won't you let the light shine through, for you. chilling for a little bit uh, definitely finding out the limitations of the current setup being that we are rubbing hard uh, right there a lot of rubbage going on and all up in here so uh, gonna need to find a better way to clearance that out clearance it out but we just need to get our long travel in the front then we should be good but uh, Definitely finding out things I need to change. I'm hearing a weird squeak, and I can't tell if it's my brakes or what exactly it is, but we'll dive into it. So, But so far, it's been a great day, having a blast. Got the four-wheeler, boss truck. There's so many pre-runners out here today. It is awesome. Into the night, I raise my hand to the fire. Come on, Paul. Send it, bud. Don't jump down in the middle. I thought you were doing it off the tailgate. I'm trying to build my courage up to that.
got this all over there. Sponsored by Red Bull. Yeah. We wish. <laughs> Hell yeah! Dude, that was dope! Oh, yeah. Alright, step aside, I'm not gonna watch that. <laughs> With the bread. And I was scared for nothing! Dude, when you hopped up and just went straight in, I was like, damn! Well, I figured if I tried to realign my feet, I was screwed. So it's just like, whatever, however I land, I gotta go. Nope. Alright, why was I so scared? <laughs> So we are currently separated from Brent. Um, he decided, he said, oh, we're going to the bathroom, the Porta Johns. So we went to the Porta Johns, and I think he went back to the entrance. And so now we're just kind of like, oh, we'll go chill close to where we were, but I'm like a high point to look for him. And we're wondering if he's waiting at the bathroom for us. So just kind of chilling here. my front suspension I'm like oh it's fine and I'm like looking Wait, in my rear view mirror and I'm like I can see clear as day out no, so this dude happens to be one of the casualties of messing around with the dudes oh man that's that's fun oh, yeah. oh I'm sure Man, can't say I didn't send it. Yeah, I definitely can't say you didn't send it. Craig's, Holy. Craig's definitely going to low bomb it now. Yeah. Damn, son. I was feeling so good, too. I was like fucking punching it. Nobody walk over here, though. Well, it's funny. I was just like, hey, I had to shut it down. I hit 230 on the trans tap. I'm going to call it. And then you're like, well, I definitely sent it. And I saw you swing around. I'm like, dude, his window's missing. Well, if you can prove you had them, they'll replace them. Like for an incident, for an incident like this. Well, honestly, I would just we'll just swing by that booth tomorrow and just be like, hey. Are they gonna be there here tonight? Cause I'd rather just be like, yo, can I get new tags? Cause I'm gonna have to get new. Well, it's, they close at ten, just like the rest of the park. All right, here's our uh, little fix for that blown out window. <laughs> <laughs> Good old duct tape. Alright guys, thanks for watching another episode of Caswell Customs. Uh, you know, we had a great time at the sand dunes. Finally back home. Trucks a mess, there's sand everywhere, but uh, awesome trip. Um, so we gotta get a little bit better about filming some stuff. Um, we didn't get a really whole lot of shots from outside of the vehicle. It was crazy busy there. So getting some of the shots that we got last year, and especially with the truck upgraded, it can handle a little bit more, was kind of difficult, but um, we had a great time. You know, we filmed a bunch of stuff that we could. Um, the camper did 
awesome so that was a huge plus but uh next thing for the truck so we can actually jump at the sand dunes is going to be that long travel rear suspension so that should be here this week hopefully putting it on the following weekend uh, so I'm super stoked to get on. So go ahead and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more of the pre-runner stuff and see the bed cage install. It's going to be so awesome. Plenty of diesel content coming. We're going to be doing the top end of Brent's Cummins. Uh, Tim's talking about getting some upgrades for his truck. So tons going on. And uh, I think Tim found, or I think Paul found a hookup for getting his rear windshield replaced. So uh, we probably won't show that, but his windshield is okay. So that was uh, that was crazy. I can't believe that happened. But uh as always, thanks for watching. Go ahead, like, share, subscribe to the channel. I'm Vinny. See you in the next one. You stole my heart of gold after my silver soul. Can you dig any deep?